Hi everyone and welcome back to DeFi Daily, the channel where every day we talk about DeFi going through different analysis, tutorials and news. Today we are going to talk about Meyer Exchange, that is the first, the, the first of its kind into the Elrond ecosystem, that is a blockchain that is implementing the sharding architecture that will be also used by Ethereum 2.0 and it is allowing to uh, speed up transactions at uh, a lower gas fees. What we will see today is how we can use the uh, Meyer DEX because it is offering right now some really insane APY. We are talking something like 6% per day. If you think about it, that's completely crazy. One time we were looking just for, and we were happy when we were uh, finding some opportunity to earn something like the 6% per year. Right now, it is quite normal to find opportunities are paying you the 6% per day. Obviously, this is not free of risk and we will see together what you have to pay attention and how you can use this kind of platform. Before to start, I would like to ask you to subscribe to the channel. All you have to do is just to press the subscribe button and remember also to press the ring bell button if you want to receive a notification every time I post a new video. Remember also to leave me a big thumbs up and if you want to also drop me a comment it would be more than appreciated because in this way you can help me to uh, grow the channel and also other people to find this kind of content that could be useful for many people in order to understand how DeFi works. Remember also that all the contents in this channel are just for educational purpose and nothing has to be intended as a financial advice. Do always your own research before doing anything. Okay guys, let's start and I would like to show you how the uh, Meyer uh, exchange is working right now. As you can see, it has born just by a couple of days because the first day, the day of the launch was just the 19th of uh, uh, November and the total value uh, locked inside the platform has literally skyrocketed in neither um, a couple of days. Right now we are already over 2 billion. And the simple, simple reason because it is happening is due to the really insane APR that the farming feature is offering. As you can see here, we are talking about 2000% of APR on the pool between the Elrond coin with the token of the platform. And it is still really high, even if you are looking for the uh, pair uh, Elrond coin with USDC. In this case, we are talking about 1000%. And remember, in the moment when we are talking about APR, it means not compounded interest. Just to give you an idea, the 6% per day, that is what you will obtain through the 2000% uh, of APR, is even higher than what you can obtain through, for example, Wonderland money that everyone is talking about that is offering some insane, some so high APY. But even in this case, this opportunity, the Meyer exchange, is offering a, an, AP, an APY that is even higher. Before showing you exactly how does it work, I want to align to you a fact. As you can see from this document that you, that you can retrieve from the uh, Ma Meyer exchange documentation, as you can see, the level of uh, rewards that will be distributed through the token of the platform will uh, decrease week by week. As you can see, right now we are in the first week and the level of rewards is 2 uh, million tokens that will be distributed. The second week we will have 1 million and a half, the third 1 million and so on, until arriving to the ninth and the twelfth week when only 50k of tokens will be distributed. So as you can easily understand, the APR that you are seeing right now, it will not last forever, but will uh, diminish every uh, week. But in any case, it doesn't mean that this is not an opportunity to, to take, because obviously talking about 6% APR is something that is really insane. And there is also the opportunity to even double this kind of APR in a way that I will show you uh, later in the moment when we will go through a step-by-step -step procedure on how to use at best this uh, platform. What I want to show you before going uh, deeper inside of it is also talking about the risk. 
What I really love by this platform is just focusing on a couple of pairs. We are not seeing so many different pools, but just two pools. One, the MEX, so the token of the, the platform plus the Elrond coin. And on the other side, the Elrond coin plus the USDC. There are not many other options. The only uh, other option that you have, it is just taking the MEX with an APR of 463. And if you're wondering why you should use this feature and not the other uh, two pools that are offering some APR that is much, much, much higher, the reason is quite simple. If you are using a single asset staking, you will start earning some rewards without any impermanent loss. On the other side, when you are using, when you are staking some LP tokens, so an LP token that is representing the liquidity or that you have added to the first pool, for example, the uh, Elrond plus uh, the token of the platform or the Elrond plus the USDC. In both of the cases, if the price of the tokens inside the pool is moving, you will have also to pay for an impairment loss. And this is something obviously that will affect your earnings. So that's the reason why even if the APR is much lower on the staking feature of a single asset, even in this case, do all your math because it could be even more convenient than just staking NLP tokens. Another thing that you have to remember, as you can see here, beware of the 1% penalty applied when exiting farms in the first 72 hours, uh, 96 hours. So it means that in order to not pay a penalty fee, you will have to wait for at least four days. But let's have a look on how does it work. I will start saying that in order to use this uh, exchange, you will need some uh, coin, some tokens into the Elron blockchain. And it's not so difficult to retrieve them, but you have to pay attention of a couple of things. You can use, uh, the first option is just go clicking here on the three dots and then bridge. And on this interface, you will have the opportunity to bridge your uh, USDC from Ethereum to Elrond. You have just to select the blockchain, the starting blockchain. In this case, we are talking about uh, moving from Ethereum to Elrond and then providing the address of your Elrond wallet. But there is a problem. As you can see here, note that there is a minimum of 2,500 USDC and a $50 USDC fee per swap. And that's a quite high fee. My advice is that it's much better just to use an exchange. For example, in this case, we can use Qcoin. You have just to swap the token of the coins that you have already inside your Qcoin account. Just go on withdraw, select Elrond, select the network. As you can see, the network is the Elrond network and move the amount that you want to move. That's quite much cheaper because the fees on the Elrond network are quite lower than just using a bridge through Ethereum. Once you have your Elrond coins into your uh, wallet, you can start using the uh, Meyer exchange. First of all, you have to connect the wallet. As you can see, there are three different uh, uh, opportunities. The first one is using the uh, Meyer app that you can retrieve it from this uh, website, themeyer.com. And here you can find uh, some other information about uh, the company because the group that is behind the exchange is also uh, the same and the app is quite easy to use. What I love uh, personally from them is that the user interface, the user experience is quite clean and the way it is working is really smooth. And this is something that I have really appreciated using their uh, tools. Uh, the other opportunity is just using your ledger. You have obviously to install on your ledger uh, the app, but once you have installed it, you can uh, start using it also on uh, the Meyer exchange. The last solution is probably the easiest one is the Elrond web wallet. And if you wanna use it, you have just to click here, learn how to set up a wallet. Just click on it and you will be redirected on wallet.elrond.com, create. And here you can just follow uh, all the steps in order to create. 
as you can see, you will have to write your uh, secret phrase and so on. In this case, I will just close the uh, page because I'm not interested to open another uh, wallet into the Alron blockchain. Once you have done it, you have just to connect it and you are ready to start. The first feature that is offered by the Meyer Exchange is the swapping feature and this is something that is really important because it will allow you to uh, exchange, for example, your Elrond coin to uh, the other coin that you, or tokens that you are needed in order to start farming. Let's say that we want to farm this uh, uh, pool here, we will need 50% on uh, Elrond coin plus a 50% on MEX uh, uh, tokens. So let's go back here, just select uh, uh, Elrond coins and uh, select half of the amount that you have in your wallet. Remember that you have always to save a, at least a minimum part of your Elrond coins into your wallet in order to pay for the transaction fees. And this is really important because if for any reason you will not have any more Elron coin into your wallet, you will not be able to interact anymore with any smart contract into this blockchain and you will have to repeat this uh, process withdrawing, for example, from KuCoin and moving your coins into, the, into your Elron wallet. Once you have swapped and you have a 50% of both of the assets that you are needed in order to add liquidity, all you have to do is just to go here on liquidity, select the uh, pool that is active right now. Let's say, for example, that we have say that we're going to add liquidity to this one. Just select add liquidity, select the amount, just confirm the transaction and you are done. Remember that you will have to sign each transaction with your wallet. Once you have completed this step, you will receive some LP tokens that are representing the liquidity that you have just added to uh, the platform. Once you have completed this step, you can go back on uh, the farming feature, just select the pool that you're interested in, uh, press stake, and here you will have just to select the amount. Uh, in this case, you can obviously add the whole amount that you have into your wallet. And as I said to you before, there is a lock rewards in order to get up to two times the APR. And how does it work? If you go here, you will receive all the information. All you have to know is that your rewards will be locked for around 18 months, so one year and a half. I'm saying around because after the first year, you will start unlocking your rewards a certain percentage each month. In any case, you have to pay attention because it's not important if you're locking them after 13 months, 16 months or whatever. The point is that you should truly believe in this project because uh, one year and a half, it's really a long term in the, into the crypto space and everything can change. Personally, I'm not a fan of this uh, feature. I am understanding that it could be a great incentive for people to lock their uh, rewards and it will take out also some selling pressure. This is something that is really good for the price of the token. In any case, I personally, I will never use this kind of locking feature for the only reason that I prefer to sell liquid on the market and to react accordingly to what is happening into the market. In any case, if you truly believe in the project, if you believe in the long term period and you believe that the Meyer Exchange and also the Elrond blockchain, because remember, the Meyer Exchange will be successful only if the Elrond blockchain will be a success. So you have to believe on both of the projects. If it's so, in this case, just locking your rewards for around one year and a half could be a good idea because you are just doubling your APR that is already an insane APR that, and that's for sure something that could be much more appreciated. Once you have done it, you, you are done. Remember that in the moment when you want to harvest all of your rewards, there is a minimum amount that you can uh, harvest and this amount right now is $20. So it means that if you are depositing inside a pool just a small amount and this amount is not sufficient to uh, reach the $20 uh, threshold, you will be unable to uh, collect your rewards. So always do well your math and be aware of all the constraints and the limits that are going through this 
platform. The same is going on when you are just taking the single asset. All you have to do is just press the staking feature. Even here you have the opportunity to just lock in your rewards and doubling your APR. And you have also the opportunity to do the reinvest all, but the reinvest all is like a compounding feature. But even in this case, this compounding feature has always the threshold of $20 in order to be able to use it. So as you can understand, we are talking about a platform that has been growing like crazy because right now we have a total value lock that is almost 2.5 billion. And that's really an insane amount if you think that this platform has been on the market just by a couple of days. If you ask my personal opinion about this platform, I say I would say that it's quite positive. I really liked what they have done. I like their interface, the user's experience. I like the way they have approached the market. My major question is what will happen in the moment when the APR will go down? And that's also uh, the first reason why I much prefer to stay liquid on the market and not to uh, lock my funds for a so long term. I prefer a strategy that is just a farm and dump strategy. So I'm just depositing my coin or, or tokens and LP tokens, uh, collecting my rewards and leave in the moment when the APR is not any more sustainable. In any case, keep an eye on uh, the Alron ecosystem because this is just the first of its kind into this ecosystem, but it's quite probable that in the next future we will see many other exchanges that are coming and we'll be also able to offer some insane APY exactly how we have seen on this day when we were talking about uh, uh, the Kronos chain. Keep an eye also uh, into the price of Elrond because if the DeFi ecosystem of Elrond will grow, also the price of Elrond could be uh, positively uh, affected. So keep an eye also on that. Guys, as always, if you appreciate this kind of content, leave me a big thumbs up. And if you want to drop a comment, I would be more than appreciated. And guys, I will see you tomorrow with another video. Bye, guys.